Hi, this is Durga Prasadhan, my registered number is ER15 CS220. Today I am going to explain about the web technology lab experiment by using the jQuery part. So, here in order to use the jQuery part, first of all, you need to download the jQuery file from uh, jQuery.com and from there I have downloaded this jQuery 1.12.0 min.js and that I have attached it here. So, and after that, uh, whatever the script I am writing in JavaScript, uh, jQuery to be written inside the script tags. And uh, here I have written the XML, HTML code. So, for example, like I have created the touch to hide option button. And for that thing, I have used the uh, P tag for it. And the input type button, uh, like ID equal to P1. So, by using this ID, I am going to write a function in order to show some alert for the thing. So here I have used the uh, even I have here so document dot ready function and whenever I click on p1 dot click function should start and an alert message will come by saying yeah it is working and in the same way if I want to use any uh, other things like uh, see here I have written in a paragraph by using id equal to p2 and if I want to if I click on it, it should hide. It should hide, and if I click on uh, show, it should show. So that thing, I have used this IDP2 in order to create another function, say uh, that is here IDP2. So document dot ready function. Whenever the uh, file we run it, then automatically this ready function will start. And when I click on the P2 button, then it starts hide. And if I click on the P2 show, then it starts showing the function. So this is how uh, uh, we can include the several features like we can animate the pictures, we can fade out, fade in and some uh, slide down, slide up operations. We can use it in a responsive web pages to create some interactiveness with the users. So this is how we can include the uh, JavaScript file and when we run it, we can easily understand that. So. So here is the tab. So first one, when I touch it on, it should hide and show alert. And alert will display here. And if I want to slide up, I'll slide it up. And if I want to slide down, I'll slide it down. And fade out is like uh, colors will disappear. And fade in, colors will come out. And click to animate, or we can animate the pictures. And so we can write the text and click it on a page when we click it on a button the news data will be displayed so this is how we can use the javascript jquery in html thank you